What is going on guys today? We have got a party bag and I say party bag like that because it's a funny one. Again, it is one of the ones with Road to the Final, Rule Breakers, Record Breakers, Team of the Group Stage, Freeze, Headliners, Future Star, What If and Foot Birthday. There is nine different teams in this. I just don't get how they call it a party bag and I understand that they're trying to make it kind of like you can get anybody and I do respect the fact that you can get a lot of players like there's a Messi in there there's an Mbappe there's a Ronaldo but it just seems like such a cop out in terms of kind of just what you can actually get it is a relatively cheap one one in form this time with an 84 rated team we should be able to do it pretty easily with all of the fodder that we've got um, i don't know what the chem is but we will just have a look we'll just chuck a load of players in and see where we can go from it so let me know down below who did you get we will just whack as many players as possible in. Maybe able to get some 82s in there as well, which will be fantastic. But overall, to be honest, it's just a pack, really. Oh, it's 50 chem. That's not that bad, actually. So if we go like this, we should be able to uh, put very little players into it that actually cost um, just from it. So if we go like you, move you there, put you like that. We'll go with a center back somewhere. Our teller's on our left back. That should do some it free cam and what about we move you across there we go easily 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 done all right we can take him out can we take an 85 out that's the question uh 85 no can we take let's have a look at another 83 just to see if we can get it out we want to get it as efficient as possible because obviously we've still got a Jovino to do and i want to keep as much fodder flying in this club as possible so we'll go with van der beek see if we can take an 84 out we can let's see if we can take another one out now obviously right we've got a few of them in here now then so can we take an 83 out no so can we i doubt we can take an 84 out now no, so we are pretty much bang on there. I think that is everybody that I want in there. Obviously, who did we take 85 out? Oh, no, we didn't. We didn't take an 85 out. I thought we took... No, we couldn't. That was it. We couldn't take that out. So that's absolutely fine. 50 chem, relatively cheap. Obviously, we have to use an 82 in form as we're not purchasing one. Um, it's just one that I've got untradeable. Full party bag. I think I've done every single one. And at the minute, haven't really had anybody that's worthwhile. I think the best one I've had is Rule Breaker Lorente as we used his in form. So hopefully we do get somebody. Obviously, Bronze Pat Method is paying out quite nicely. Let's just see what we get. Let me know down below who you got. And if you'd like to see more content like this. Obviously, we're doing packs as much as possible. We... Oh, no. Who is this going to be? Oh, no, no, no. Oh, is that... Oh, we've already got him as well. 82 rated. And this is why I hate it. This, this genuinely is why I hate it. We've already got him untradeable. I know that much. But what is the point, honestly? An 82 rated card for that 84 rated team. Sometimes you do lose. Obviously, I did keep him like that just because I can use him in um, either the marquee matchups or we could actually use him in Jovino. So I think what I'm going to do, because Jovino is one SBC and I think it's an 85, if we put an 82 in there, more than likely we're going to have to use some very, very high rated fodder. So we're going to go and use it into marquee matchups just to kind of make something a little bit cheaper as I think... It is relatively done. So 80 rated, yeah, Arsenal. We're going to put it into this and just go from there. Right, so first one done. We've gone with a Bundesliga as obviously that league SBC has been finished. So obviously we're going to wait for that one to come back. We have used the 82, which... It, I suppose it is what it is really, isn't it? It's no no point worth crying over. Obviously, we will try again with the next party bag, as we always do. And eventually, one potentially could hit. So, if we could get a walkout to make up for it. Not in this one. No board. We will try and do all of market matchups before we finish off today. Because sometimes you never know. Sometimes you do get something decent. Uh, we end up with a lot of players that we can just whack straight into the club. And hopefully... We can get something big out of this. Another foot birthday packed would be nice. So far, we've only got Simon and we've got Hermoso. So both of them player picks. I'd like to see something big if possible. Next one done. 
Easy one as well again. Bundesliga, we're just going to be absolutely rinsing down to the ground until it comes back out. And then again, we will smash it out. Prime Electrum for this one. Can we find ourselves our first walkout of today? Come on. We do. What is that? Oh, it's just a gold. Come on, someone big then. Ooh, Modric. We take a Modric. We absolutely take a Modric. Obviously, fodder-wise, we're trying to keep as many of the tradable to sell on just to make our profit back. So I'll absolutely take a Modric. We are looking for that foot birthday flair, if possible. But we get Modric at, what is he coming in at? About 30k at the moment. What's his range? So more than likely, with a player pick or with like an icon pack, you can see it probably going over 45. A couple of good silvers. Again, we'll just whack everything up and deal with that a little bit later after we finish these final two. Next one up, managed to uh, get that one done. A little bit more over the rating, but we managed to use a lot of players that we don't really use. Edivisier can come a little bit later as we still need to really kind of bump up our rares in there. No walkout or board in this one, though. So we go into the final one and obviously the final pack to finish off with. Just see what sort of fodder. Obviously, you can still get a few decent players. Obviously, UCLs at the moment are going to be worth keeping. And then when that SBC comes back out, we probably will see a little bit of an influx in price to that one as well. Right then, the final one finished. Can we get anything? I don't even know what the final pack is. We've got a jumbo gold pack from this one and marquee match complete with prime gold players. To be honest, they have been woeful for me over the past whole time of FIFA so far. So then jumbo, jumbo gold pack up first. What can we get? Anybody? We get a we get a rare. No, no boards, no boards. We skip this one. See what sort of fodder we get. Obviously, consumables are going to be massive in this one to try and hope. We got a lot of players, which is always nice. CDM to CM, striker to CF. Yes, please. 5k instant. You love to see it. Everything else can go up. And we can just discard most of this. And then deal with the, the rest of the consumables later. And then we can finish on a prime gold players. One in four, one, uh, one walkout so far. Can we get anything from the prime? Like I say, these are normally not amazing. But, nope. We get a board. We get a board. So we got one walkout and a board, which is going to be uh, Jean Martino, 83. Not really the greatest player in the world. But again, it's a board. It's a board. All of it's tradable. So obviously, if it goes into the club or we can use it elsewhere, um, it's not terrible. We'll deal with the rest later. But hopefully you did enjoy the video. Hopefully you did get a better party back than me. Let me know down below what you got. Make sure you like and subscribe. Peace.